Lost in your eyes, take the pain from my heart. Make me smile with your presence. I can breathe better with your arms around me. A kiss that traps my soul. I don't want to find my way home. Lost in your eyes. I want you fast asleep. basically decided to start writing at 17. The poem that I wrote was called Darkest Room, and it was just one of those like negative, dark, frustrating poems that I wrote. It's just the way you feel at the time, so, you know, as being a teenager and just feeling like things are coming down upon you, so you just write. I was just trying to express me. I was just trying to express how I felt at that moment. It's like a therapeutic journey. Like, it's, it's something a doctor can't prescribe. The thought of poetry just is just an excitement for me. It just re releases like a, a negative air out of me sometimes. Like, I just feel relieved after I write something because I, I, it's like I'm telling somebody how I feel without actually speaking to a person. Mostly on my wall, I would have a lot of other poems that I found that inspired me. I found one called Confession Number no. 6, and it's about sacrifice. Someone is telling the other person, no matter where you are in the world or anything, like, I just want you to have to use every second of the day to just come see me. When I write my poetry, most of the time, I like to use a lot of personification. Like, I made, like in Misery, Misery is an actual person to me. And love and lust and hate can be actual people. And in my poem, Dare Lie, like, lie and truth are, are for me, they come into a human form. My favorite subjects are love and sex and anger. The things that I write, the majority of people that read them are my friends and they come back to me with like smiles on their face and they like understand like what I'm going through. I do want to write a book of, of poetry and I want to use it as, also as a stepping stone to write, you know, a novel or short stories and just I just want to use my creativity in any way to, you know, get through in life. I dedicate my writings mostly to my friends and what they're going through in their own lives. What I want them to get out of my poetry is freedom. The majority of my inspiration comes from my family and just the natural surrounding of just living in New York just inspires me to write poetry. I let majority of the people that I know that I write poetry and that's what makes up Ian Tyrone Stevens. <laughs>